We've all been there. You go food shopping expecting to fill a basket, but walk out with two carts of food. But don't feel bad, it's exactly what they want you to do. Hey, I'm Jillian on Buzz60. Here are some ways supermarkets try to get you to spend more than you planned. It's all about the layout. Not so much the shape of the store, but where things are. The most common items, eggs, bread, milk, and meat, are usually in the back, with the hopes you'll see something you weren't planning on getting and make an impulsive buy. Another placement trick is putting fruits and vegetables right when you walk in. Studies show that if you buy healthy stuff first, you won't feel bad about buying less healthy stuff like chips. Speaking of, ever notice how the chips and dip are always together, and usually right near the soda? It may feel like just a convenience to you, but that's exactly the point. Grocery stores are banking on the fact that you'll figure it's a good idea to buy the dip since you're already buying the chips. More specifically, shelf placement. The things at eye level are the first to grab your attention, so that's usually where the more expensive items are. You'll most likely find a better deal on a higher or lower shelf. If you've ever lost track of time in a grocery store, that's because they generally don't have windows, so you can't gauge time by natural light. At least not when you're actually shopping. There are usually windows by the register, but by then the damage has been done. Kinda like a casino, only you didn't have to mortgage your house or pawn priceless family heirlooms. At least I hope not. But 60, now you know, pass it on.